Hi friends, today we will be talking about the three extra steps that are required for complete oxidation of an odd carbon containing fatty acid. When an odd car odd number of carbon atoms containing fatty acid undergoes beta oxidation, the process continues smoothly till they und undergo a last step where a 5 carbon intermediate is formed. In this last pass through the beta oxidation, where this 5 carbon intermediate is cleaved, there is formation of two products. One is acetyl CoA, which enters the citric acid cycle, and other is the propanyl CoA. For this propanyl CoA to enter into the citric acid cycle, it has to undergo three enzymatic steps. We will look at these in detail. In the first step, the propanyl CoA is carboxylated. So the first step is carboxylation, which is catalyzed by propanyl CoA carboxylase. Propanyl CoA carboxylase is an enzyme which has biotin as the cofactor. So CO2, it first combines with biotin to form carboxybiotin and this carboxybiotin donates the carbon to propanyl CoA, the CO2 to propanyl CoA to form D-methylmalonyl CoA. This requires an expenditure of energy which is provided by hydrolysis of ATP. So ATP is hydrolyzed to form ADP and PI. Carbon dioxide is transferred to propanyl CoA and there is formation of d methyl CoA. So there we complete the first step. Propanyl CoA carboxylated by propanyl CoA carboxylase to form d methyl CoA. This then undergoes epimerization by methyl CoA epimerase. The D stereo isomer is converted to L methyl CoA. So, epimerization of the D form to the L form by methyl CoA epimerase. In the last step, this L methyl CoA it undergoes an intermolecular rearrangement by methyl CoA mutase, which requires coenzyme B12 as its cofactor, converting L methyl CoA into succinyl CoA. And we know that succinyl CoA is the intermediate of citric acid cycle. So succinyl CoA now enters the citric acid cycle completing the process of uh, complete oxidation of this odd number of carbon containing fatty acids. Propanate, you will find it also enters our diet because propanate is added as an inhibitor of mold in breads and in cereals. Propanate is also found as a product of fermentation in cattle and other ruminants. So this propanyl CoA undergoes these three enzymatic steps to form succinyl CoA which subsequently enters the citric acid cycle. Thank you.